everyone. Uh, my name is Luis Rodriguez. I'm for Bean Architecture. I today I want to show how to uninstall the Autodesk app. If you know uh, there is some troubles with uh, this update from Windows and Autodesk app, it doesn't work uh, if you update this Windows. Uh, but for now, I uninstall the Autodesk app or reinstall again to uh, try to fix this uh, problem that uh, usually have. And for this thing, the the need the first thing that you need to do is go to a control a panel control, and then you need to search uh, your software on install. And for this case, I uninstall yet. yet. And then uh, I search a page. It's a really useful page that this is the original uh, post. And you can see for now this is in Spanish because uh, I am an, uh, a Spanish speaker, but you, you can uh, put in English if, if you want. And then you think you need to know that the first thing that you need to do uh, for uninstall anything software is you don't have uh, running. For this case, you go to Task Manager and you need to uh, end the end, end task for uh, then you can uh, uninstall uh, any software. Then when you uninstall this software, you need to go uh, to your uh, folder. And for this case, for Windows 10, you need to go to view and then you need to click in uh, show uh, hide elements. Then you need to search. Uh, if you see you have new folders that you can see, you need to go to program data, Autodesk, and then in Autodesk you need to search if exists the uh, Autodesk desktop app. If doesn't exist, uh, it's pretty sure uh, you don't have problem. But if this uh, folder exists, you need to delete and. The another thing that you need to go to user, then your name, and then app data, roaming, roaming, and then you need to search uh, Autodesk again, and you need to search uh, the Autodesk desktop app. And if you don't have, really, it's really good. Uh, maybe you uninstall well to this part. And if you have, you need to delete. When you have this uh, element delete, you need to go to search regedit. And you need to uh, go inside like administrator. Then uh, you have this one, uh, K class road. Uh, and we need to go to a uh, clay local machine and then to go to software and then in software you need to search a uh, wo uh, 6432 and then go to autodesk and you need to try to search autodesk application manager then you need to delete uh, this folder this is like the current uh, elements that it doesn't delete yet but uh, this is like the manually stuff that you need to do if your software it wasn't installed. Okay, this is then you need to go to Microsoft and you need to search uh, the. Let me let me search to Windows and then in Windows you need to search current version and then you need to search again uninstall in uninstall there are there are a lot of uh, temporal elements and for this case you need to uh, search the autodesk app if it doesn't exist uh, is delete it's okay but if exists this element you need to delete before you install again any software 
yeah, for this case, I, I delete the element. I uninstall the software with a special uh, software. And there is uh, some element that, there are some element that uh, the software delete, there are some element that it doesn't delete. And then I, I need to search the software and then go to Microsoft. And in Microsoft, I need to search again a Windows and Windows current version, current version and app paths and add paths like the page set. You need to delete this this one, this element that appears in the page uh, that is add app uh, management and Autodesk desktop app. Uh, for my case, I have delete this element, but if you don't have, you need to delete this one. Yeah. And when you finally delete all these elements, uh, you you need to uh, have this post in English, and you you click, and this uh, relink to the page that you can download the Autodesk app. Then you need to click and go like administration, and it's uh, install the software for the updates and plugins from Autodesk. You need to wait some uh, time. It's a pen for your uh, machine or your computer. And if you see uh, it's installing, they appear the, the logo of the software. And then when it's finished, it appears this page, this like the beginning page. Now, when you uh, open, you see that it's work again, the this page. Um, that's all. And don't forget to subscribe. And thank you very much.